Oh my god. god. Like who would who would have thought? We're watching Saw. Saw. Mate, I've you just the, broke all the discs. Broke all the discs. <laughs> People are gonna be like, I can't believe it. I uh, I bought the seven film collection on Blu-ray. And we're watching all we seven watch today. All seven. All today. Marathon. Marathon um, of Saw. Now, I'm just gonna say this. It says Saw Saw two, three, four, five, six. Then it says Saw the final chapter. Why do they lie? It's it, it's always Why the case. Do they I mean, lie to isn't, us? isn't um isn't Friday the thirteenth part four the final chapter? And there's five more. And there's five more. <laughs> And then, isn't Money. there a final chapter of like Nightmare on Elm Street? So I don't know. What is your experience with Saw, mate? Um, so my so, knowledge of Saw is from I scary movies. I haven't seen it, have you? And I haven't even seen scary movies. I just remember some guy sawing off his leg, but it's the wrong one. And that's isn't that scary, scary movie. movie four? I think. Yeah. Uh, is that scary movie four? Wrong foot. <laughs> I thought it was the first. Scary it movie. might be. I don't know. Um, but apart from that, I know it's James Wan, and it's one of his first. Is it? Yeah, it's, it's one of his first um, major films. He actually did a short film of this and uh, it got picked up and uh, turned into a, a full feature length film, I think, I believe. I, I, I'm pretty sure I'm right on that. So obviously this sparks a kind of wave of uh, modern horror films that people call torture porn films. Yeah, but I think that, 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 that was very present before Saw. I have also heard that this is quite a cool detective story as well. So I don't okay. know whether it is just going to be people getting brutally killed. In the so mini games. I've, I've never seen it either, but I've obviously heard of all the different games brutal, brutality yeah. of it. Yeah. So I'm going into it thinking it's going to be the most gruesome film I've ever seen. But <laughs> This is the last, the last modern, modern horror. horror. However, that we are, we've currently got a... Uh, a um, a poll, a on Patreon, Patreon poll all, on, up, and their the series Wreck, uh, which is a modern horror, is currently winning by like twenty votes. Oh, jeez! So, <laughs> so we'll be we'll, horror won't be going away after this. <laughs> I'm sure our pa our patrons will think of some uh, way of uh, including uh, horror back into our uh, lives. There's no escaping it, Tom. There's no escaping. We started with horror, and we'll never let it go. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. I love my gore, you know, Hellraiser, you know. Um, I just wonder dead. what the type of gore this is going to be. Is it going to be? It's going like, to be like brutal, really brutal. Yeah, not like Evil Dead, where it's no. like neon red blood sort no. of spraying in his face as yeah. a chainsaw or something. No. no, it's not going to be like that. It's going to be like dark blood. But you sold me. You sold me. Let's okay. go. Let's go and watch it. Oh, I hate anything like that or water. Yeah, drowning. It's terrifying, but at the same time, it's supposed to be quite relaxing. I'm, I'm definitely sure it's not. <laughs> what was that? I went down the plug off. Something. Is someone there? Oh my god. Ooh. <clears throat> I swear that's Lee Wannell. Is it? Yeah. He directed The Invisible Man? Yeah. Oh! He shoot himself. <laughs> what is going on? No! This is a good intro, isn't it? Yeah. Calm down. Just, just calm down. What's going on here? My name is Lawrence Gordon. I'm a doctor. I just woke up here, just like you. Is he handcuffed as well? No. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. They, yeah. So the legs change. Yeah. Well, Adam, what we need to do is start thinking about why we're here. He's got no shoes. Oh. Play me. What is that? It's a tape. Well, where'd you find it? It's in my pocket. He'd been awake. You, he hadn't checked yeah, your you pockets. Yeah, you didn't check your pockets. You always check your pockets first. Bullet. Oh, there's a gun in the middle of the room. A key. This is interesting, it's intriguing, isn't it? Yeah. Don't just throw it. It's obviously there for a reason. Right and shine, Adam. You're probably wondering. 
wondering where you are, I'll tell you where you might be. You might be in the room that you die in. Up until now, you've simply sat in the shadows, watching others live out their lives. But what do voyeurs see when they look into the mirror? Oh, yeah. Six o'clock. There's a man in the room with you. When there's that much poison in your blood, the only thing left to do is shoot yourself. If you do not kill Adam by six, then Allison and Diana will die. Dr. Gordon. I didn't know they'd be turned against each other. A saw. Uh, it is called saw, saw isn't yeah. it? Yeah, you forget why is it originally called saw, like... <laughs> There's no way. No, you're just gonna blunt the blade, mate. He doesn't want us to cut through our chains. He wants us to cut through our feet. Ah! I think I may know who's done this to us. What did you say? The house? Last I heard, police still hadn't caught him. The only reason I know that is because I was a suspect. That's why he's called Jigsaw. Yeah. Hello, Mark. If you're so sick, then why do I have so many photos of you up and about? Now, there's a slow-acting poison in your veins. The antidote is inside the safe. The combination to the safe is written on the wall. Oh my God. Oh, he's off lost. Ben Minus. It's a very Frost. interesting person. As you can see, our orderlies form very special bonds with the patients. What is this all about? This is yours, Doctor. Hmm. That was five months ago. So he was tied into it from the start. Mm. So the killer must know him. We have one of the victims who managed to escape. Mm. I want to know if you wouldn't mind sticking around and listening to her testimony. God's sake. <laughs> I was wondering if this puppet would come into it. Huh. That is terrifying. It's the worst one, yeah. There is only one key. At least it's quick. Device. It's in the stomach of your dead soulmate. Come on. No, he's not alive. Just to kill him, to get out. Take it off, take it off! Oh! That was close. <laughs> Congratulations. You are still alive. Most people are so ungrateful to be alive. Why the puppet? He helped me. Are you sure it's him? Yeah. No, I'm not. <laughs> How do I know what you're telling him? <clears throat> Camera. Oh. I can see you. He's got to be a bit of a weird genius, nut to this guy. Yeah. So where's the lucky wife? There's another picture behind the one you're looking at. Oh, oh. my God. You see more with your eyes shut. It's uh, it's not here. He's taken the, the X clue. Marks the spot. He's Sometimes you see more with your eyes. He's taken. Shut. A, he's taken the clue. Give me the creeps. We <laughs> guys look at him there for the first time. Yeah. Oh.
What? Oh, is that no? That is the police officer. Oh, okay. Oh, they're following. They're following him. him. Yeah. Do you think they actually uh, are on the trail? They're on the trail. Yeah. On the trail. Oh, this this just got interesting. I'll show you. Remember 118th Street? Uh, K2K. Oh, they found it. Yeah. Could be booby traps. I'm sure you could back up now that you found it. Oh, don't look under there. It might be a trap. The hell? Oh, that's the room. What the hell is this? It makes little models. They can get him, they really can get him. What's he wearing? This is what this is who Kevin McAllister grew up to be. <laughs> Awake already, Jeff. I need more powerful tranquilizers next time. Uh uh Yeah. He's gonna escape. He's got he's got cancer then, hasn't he? Yeah, absolutely. Oh! Oh no! Why am I thinking that he's gonna get him? They're not gonna get him. Call for backup. You should have called for backup. They shouldn't have gone there by themselves. Shoot! I bet it's not him. No! <gasps> What's that? Shotgun. He's alive! Turn off the lights. Behind you. <laughs> well, it does look like a box on the wall as well. Yeah. The one from my envelope, where is it? It's gonna be through the wife, isn't it? Oh man, oh man! Yeah. <laughs> Why do they Beautiful think it's a good thing? Like he's planned all this. Why? Nine, 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 nine. It's not like they just found it out of nowhere. <laughs> So is that is the cigarette poison? Yeah. This was meant to receive calls, not make them. It's only poisonous if, if it ends, ends in lives. bloodshed. What does it mean? Think about this. You don't need a gun to kill Adam. When there's that much poison in your blood, the only thing left to do is shoot yourself. He had poison in his in his blood, so he shot himself to die. There's there's Poison in that blood, he's gonna put some blood on the cigarette. That's a bit of a stretch. Nope. There's <laughs> gotta be a lot of blood and poison in there to kill you. Yeah. Hey, what the hell are you doing? I can't see him. I want you to play along with me on this. Listen to me, I want you to play along with me on this. Oh, there's two cigarettes. Ah, I see. Good job you put two in there. <laughs> Don't overact it, mate. Oh, 
You're a f***ing idiot. You're an absolute f***ing idiot. What? I just got electrocuted! <laughs> that was the stupidest acting I've ever seen! It is. I remember everything now. I remember how I got here. It's Jason, go. J Jason Bourne. I remember everything. Oh my god, it's <laughs> Jason Bourne! <laughs> Whoa! Yeah. Yeah, multiple ones of him. He knew him already. What the yeah. hell? Daddy. I knew it. Anna. Is Adam there? How do you know? They've Adam. been sleeping together. Nah. What is going on? Don't believe Adam's lies. He knows you. He knew all about you before today. Jigsaw wants them to turn against each other. Yeah. He's told her to say that. She told me not to believe you. Believe me about what? He's just... What is he hiding? She told me you knew me. You want to know what I do? I get paid to take pictures of rich guys like you who go to seedy out-of-the-way motels to their secretaries. Last night I went to your house and I watched you move. I followed you all the way to that shitbag hotel. Hey, was there someone else at your house last night? I know him. Zap. Yeah. Oh. His name is Zep. We're out of time. What's going to happen? This must be a younger Jigsaw then, Mrs. if he Gordon? gets older. I'm gonna kill your husband now, Mrs. Gordon! How? Uh. He th problem is, he thinks they're dead. Lawrence! The same thing happened to me, I see? No idea. I wasn't lying, see? No idea what's gonna happen. Yeah, he's gonna, he's gonna sort his leg off. Oh. Oh. No, this is it. This is it, this is a 127 hours moment. Stop. Stop it. You'd want to cut it a little bit higher so you can have but like a stunt. everything there, like his acting and the reaction of the other guy is just intense. Oh. Oh, he's done it. Oh, I knew that was going to happen. I thought it would be the other guy that got killed. Damn it. Lawrence, don't! No! No, Lawrence, please! I'm begging you! I want to live! I want to live! You got one bullet. My family. <laughs> Too late. Oh! He's not dead! He pretended to be dead, perhaps. Jesus Christ! I have to go and get help. Don't leave me! Trying to look for a key on, on Jigsaw, maybe? He's not the real Jigsaw. Hello, Mr. Hindle. Or as they called you around the hospital. Yeah, so he was involved in it. This is slow acting poison coursing through your system, which only I have the antidote for. Oh my god. 
No. No. <laughs> oh my god. god. Like who would who would have thought? Key to that chain is in the bathtub. It's a very interesting person. His name is John. He has an inoperable frontal lobe tumor. Sick from the disease eating away at me inside. Sounds like our friend Jigsaw. I'm sick of people who don't appreciate their blessings. Looks like our guy likes to book himself in the seats to his own sick little demons. Hello, Mark. Poor man. Adam, Dr. Gordon. I want to play a game. He's been in there the whole time. Most people are so ungrateful to be alive. But not you. Not anymore. Game over. We finally saw it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. This was far this better, was than, way better than, than I thought, I it, thought, would I thought it would be. Yeah, 100%. I thought, because there's a stigma around the Saw franchise of it being just a meh franchise, but that's, the, just that's the, fran the sake of it. That's the maybe franchise. It becomes itself. That. Maybe it becomes, it becomes that. that yeah. But like, like, I just want to say, man. The story and how it all came together. And unfolds, yeah. How it unfolded, you know. And it was done so through flashbacks and cutaway scenes and all of these different things, but it all came together neatly. That That's that's a sign of superb and intentional hmm. writing. So I obviously knew that the old... I've seen the older guy in pictures of him. Yeah, yeah, song, yeah, same. But I was, like, convinced. I was utterly convinced it was that other guy. Yeah, yeah, the, same. The, the, the yeah. guy from uh, Lost. Because I was saying... Was I was saying as well. Maybe he's a younger guy. Maybe they yeah, recast him. He's doing it for revenge against the Doctor. Yeah. Or he hates him for that reason. But when it turned out that he was just being... Um, forced to do this stuff as well. Wow. I was yeah, like, mind blown. what the hell? Yeah. I was mind blown. And mind then, blown. and then the fact that, this was, and oh. then the fact that the, the real jigsaw has been in that room that for eight was, hours, wait, just, I know, just lying down. Yeah, it's a little bit unbelievable, but it was <laughs> epic. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, yeah, that yeah. was the saw music that I know. Yeah, yeah. And when da, that's da, Tanny was just da, like, standing in there, but I was like, what? Yeah. Uh, this is Mad. a great. This is a, such a unique story the, and well written. The fact that um, Lee Wannell's character. Like his key was in the bath with him, but he just he just accidentally unplugged the plug, and it the key went down the drain. The oh, key, well, the key I, to his chain was there, but we didn't yeah, the key. Yeah, like it could he could it could have just got out so so easily. Oh man, the fact <laughs> that he wrote this as well, him so him good. and James Wan were at it. Yeah. Oh man, when he uh, when Lee Wells' reaction when the other guy was soaring off his yeah, butt, and he was like, no, God, no, 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 no. <laughs> And I love the detective story going alongside yeah. it as well because yeah. that also amped up the tension. It's such a unique concept. And Definitely. It's for, not, for its time. Now it's, it's not, but... I'm interested to see how this plays out because then it's obviously the same jigsaw killer. Yeah, throughout all the movies. But will there be other detectives chasing him down as well? Because I think that's the strength of this and the fact that you get the backstories. Well, because where I think that the sequels could probably, possibly go wrong is that they just have the whole film within that interior place and you don't get any backstory and there's no side stories with detectives and stuff. Uh, like. Yeah, it could, it could just be a compilation of traps. Yeah, uh, which I wouldn't want. Which, which it started out to be in this movie... Uh, with the people telling the story, but it, but wasn't, it, it wasn't overdone. It wasn't, it wasn't over, about. It wasn't that. about that, and wasn't overdone. This one, this one was more. This one was really good in balancing tension because at the end you get them trying to escape the detective hunting down the guy you thinks the killer. Yeah. The women in that the mother and the daughter in the house where the yeah. mother escapes. But then you have the um, the backstories of the two main characters. So Lee Wannell's character, he's he's a detect like a, yeah. a invest internal investigator, what whatever he is, a personal investigator. But I, I'm interested to see the new movie Spiral, 
and what movies yeah, we, we would I have to see I, in order to watch yeah, that. Because I, think I, I wouldn't mind watching it straight after this. You know, do you know what I mean? Me too, because from the trailer, it says that it's... Uh, the is the it trailer, No, the trailer says the Jigsaw Killer's dead. This must be a copycat or something like that. Yeah. So it's a new detective going after a new killer, I think. Um, mm. I do want to see how his story, the killer's storyline plays out and if they catch him or what. But, you know... We've got another seven films to watch before Spiral, if we were to watch them all, which is just insane, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, let us know what you think is the best Saw movie. Obviously, you, Saw 1 is probably the best, but what is your favourites? Because, and do we have to watch them all in chronological order? I'm assuming we do. Story, we've got story rate, we've got, solid. We've got to rate it. Yeah. Let's go. Okay, let's go and rate it. Saw. Far better than I expected it to be because of the stigma that the franchise has, uh, you know, grown to be just this gore porn and, and no real story. But this one had a great story. Um, characters were interested in the story and unraveled uh, to, to, you know, unravel the characters as well. As it, so it unraveled the characters as it unraveled the story, um, which I really liked. But yeah, all in all, really liked it. I'm going to rate Saw. 7.9. Nice. Yes. Now, I like what you said about the, or maybe I said it about all the storylines diverging. Is that the right word? Coming together, converging. Yeah. Yes. Um, because the tension works really well. I love the score of this film. It's yeah. really subtle throughout. You actually do hear it. Yeah. Well. The, the gore is done in a way that's horrific, but it's not ridiculously over the top. It's no. believable, and when it does come, it's horrific. And yeah. Ah, and um, the characters were quite good too. I just love the way that the narrative's crafted in terms of um, flashbacks and multiple storylines. Yeah. Um, and it works quite well. So I could forgive some of the some of the acting. And, yeah, I was going to say, I mean? some of the like, acting wasn't I don't want to go on about the performances because they do, they do an all in right so, in, Yeah, in some scenes not, they're really good, in some scenes they're not. It's, yeah, it's yeah. a bit of a balance. Um, I just really wanted Danny Glover to survive and catch that guy. <laughs> like That twist at the end, I just did not see it coming <laughs> at all. So for that, I'm going to give it point one more just for that twist. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. Yeah. I thought it was really great. And I actually can't wait to watch the next one now. Okay. Saw. So that was Saw. Good film. Yes. Tell us one, which Eight, ones you 7. want to... 7.9. Which ones are your favourites? Which ones are your favourites? Maybe they're your favourites for a specific reason. We will get to them eventually. I, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm almost positive we will. Um, but we will be taking a break. This is our last film in the modern horror um, uh, playlist. Mm. But that doesn't mean we're not we're going to be stopping horror. Obviously... Recently, we had a Patreon poll, and currently winning is another horror movie. So, so we'll see if that comes. You know, up and, and and if you want to take part in that, if you want to make suggestions, uh, movie suggestions for us, and get in a horror movie as a suggestion, then head over to our Patreon page. Link is in the description. Our lowest tier allows you to uh, comment on movie suggestions in our live streams that we have every month, and then you get to vote on those movies as well. Drop a like and a subscribe as well if you enjoyed it. It really helps us out. Yes. And the channel. Yes. And uh, hit the notification bell to be reminded of our next playlist. Currently we've got Oscar Oscars. winning, best picture winning movies. Oscar winning, best picture winning movies. Yes. <laughs> and just movies that we want to see. That was our next one as well. I think after those we'll probably be doing comedies or something. Oh man, hopefully, yeah. We'll take a little, a little bit of a break. After this. Yeah. <laughs> But other than that, make sure you check out our merch store down below as well. Uh, and follow us on TikTok, Twitter, Instagram, subreddit. And we'll see you next time. See you in the next video. Cheers.